Wits University says it's received hundreds of emails calling for classes to resume. Learning activities remain suspended at the institution due to the ongoing fees must fall protests. Management is now relying on students and staff to help determine a way forward by means of a vote. The poll will be asking, do you want the academic program to continue even if we have to have security protocols in place? Is that something that you can live with? And they have to say yes or no. The poll will be an anonymous ballot and VET says it has approached the IEC to monitor the process. By Thursday we hope to have the poll. It will be done electronically. We've got the electronic systems in play. I've got a team working on that and they're putting that in place. We will, we will try and get somebody to steward the poll like the IEC which has credibility. Protesters have rejected the poll and say they will continue with their cause until their grievances are addressed. Wits University says it has approached the ministers of police and higher education for assistance with extra security should it decide to continue with its academic program. The university is also investigating the death of an employee over the weekend. The contract cleaner fell ill after inhaling fumes from fire extinguishers released by students at a residence hall last week. 